Hello and welcome to my first proper video on this channel. To start things off, I thought we'd have an OI game that I thought was going really well right up until the point that it didn't. I thought it was about time I put something up on this channel that wasn't just a backstage grainy footage of some Thor 2 being footed, filmed behind the scenes rubbish. Anyway, yes. People say the OI can be top tier. Sorry, can be overpowered when it's top tier. With 150mm of frontal armour. That is until it means something with a bigger gun. So I paused here as if I was actually going to manage to hit these guys. Nope, they disappeared. So we start the painful climb up the hill. How much does this thing weigh? 100 tons? Yeah, it's a good thing they never built it. I'm trying to get over to those camping heavy rocks on this side of the map. Anything around the corner? Nope, nothing there yet. Okay. We're getting near the rock. What do we got? Stug's pinging the map. Turn the light tanks to do some spotting. Oh shit, KV2. Now you hear a lot of people saying that if you can't penetrate a vehicle with armor piercing, fire high explosive at them. We've all seen videos where the KV-2 wrecks the tier 8 tanks, and he bounced. Bounced off the front. I love it when high explosive bounces. My driver's obviously been on the Saki because he can't drive straight. Other than that, he's angling against high explosive. Nearly reloaded, and he bounced again. So it's a bit of dirt balls, but I'm firing armor piercing in this. And I'm trying to mount the rock apparently. Anything else gonna come around the corner? No, no, KB2 is not going to. Back it up a bit. No, no. Bad KV2, go away. Ooh, a Stug 4. That's a very nice tank destroyer you've got there. You must have worked pretty hard to get it for all those reward missions. Artillery's doing the job. Oh, oh. Be a shame if something happened to it. Dead. Ah, artillery spotted me. Run away. Maybe two. Angle. Artillery stuns me. Bounced. M4 misses. Didn't reload in time to get the M4. Let's try this again. Artillery still having a go at me. Artillery still trying to get me. Ooh, a Hetzel. Another tank destroyer. Go and Hetz elsewhere. Dead. <clears throat> Go on, little Lukes. Kill him. Kill him with fire. M4, he's a long way. I'm gonna reload. Reload. Reload! No, never mind. <sighs> oh, I've reloaded. Artillery's still trying to get me? I don't have a spool line on this, I don't think. Maybe I should fit one. That 
birch gun's really got it in for me, isn't it? Right, let's go and kill the KV-2. And... Come on, reload. Reload. The Luke's is doing bravely. No. Leave him alone. Yep, he's damaging it. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on! I have no idea what happens to that. So I thought I'd go for the ram, but somebody got it. Never mind. Okay. Now I'm back in the bottom of it. Which again, going uphill. Artillery is still having a go. That's half my health gone. <clears throat> Luke's is going after the M4. Oh, look, an enemy Luke's. Hold still. Hold still. Stay there, let me get the gun cranked round. And dead. What about the M4? Or oh, that looks. Not reloaded. Not reloaded. It's <sighs> trouble with big guns. Artillery is still having a go. 2% on the M4. And good night. So, four kills. We're outnumbered, four to three. The artillery is still bouncing off me. Ooh. Ooh. Tank destroyer. Can I get the gun depression? No. Need someone to spot him again. Two artillery, a light tank, and a tank destroyer. Against a heavy tank, medium tank, if you can call them Tilda Black Prince a medium tank, and a light tank. Oh. No. It's a pity buildings don't collapse better in this. Drop a house on somebody. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? I go and help the loops over there. <sighs> oh, someone driving through the cap circle. It's probably that enemy loops. Matilda's over there, but he's. What is that Matilda doing? Probably trying to spot the cap circle. Yes. Our oh, little Luke's in this is brilliant. The enemy one's not doing too badly. So, another slow climb up the hill. to go. Our Luke's is on quite low health. How low is his health? 42%. Oh, that's not too bad. Okay, can't see him, so he's got to be behind that building. I did get, a, did get a bit confused at that point, then I remembered that you can just about hide behind that building. 30 seconds. At this point, I thought if I got into the cap circle, it would stop the cap, but as we're about to find out, it doesn't. Will he cap in time? No, he's left the cap circle. But I need to stop. Okay. Fortunately, I didn't realise this, but Matilda has spotting on that side of the building, so I just drive around this side. And he kills him. Good. Right. One heavy and one medium against two artillery. And here we go for the long slog. Artillery's still having a go. 
At this point I realised that we had seven kills between us, so I invited him to a platoon. Luke starts telling us where the uh, enemy artillery will be, but we're going as fast as we can. Still just not sure. And again, he's not been sure this whole game. Painful climb up the hill. Matilda's still actually heading this way. He is, he's kind of heading off to that far corner while I'm heading for the cap circle. That might come back and bite us in the arse later on, you never know. Luke's is still spamming the map. Oh, I can see the cap circle! No sign of the artillery yet. And they're not shooting at me, so presumably they can't see me. I don't I think I... No, I don't have sixth sense on this. I'm on the home straight to the cap circle. See if I can draw out the artillery. Now, who's guessed at this point what's going to happen? You might be thinking, yeah, I'll pull into the cap circle, one of them will spot me, the other one will shoot me, reset the cap and it'll be a draw. Or they'll kill me and it'll be a loss. Let's see. Nearly at the cap circle. Oh, you're kidding. I was checking the corners for the artillery, but yep, there it is. <sighs> now I thought because there's only one of them in the cap circle, I thought the other one was going to be down here shooting at me. And this is how two tanks, with seven kills between them, lost a game to two artillery by capping. Matilda's stuck right in the middle of the map. No idea what to do. Ooh, do I go that way? Do I go that way? With 20 seconds to go, there's nothing we can do. There's now two of them in the cap circle. Three seconds to go, I take point randomly in the direction of the cap circle. Fire blind, just for something to do. And we lost. So that's Steel Wall, Brothers in Arms, Shell Proof, and Fighter Medals. Four kills, 2330 damage. Block my armour. And only a third class mastery badge. Probably says a lot about the OI. The Luke's on our team got an Orlix medal. I had to look that one up. You get it for killing two or more enemy tanks or tank destroyers at least one level higher than you. Not bad at all. Anyway, that's it for my first video. Let me know what you think. Um, also let me know if you've had any more... If you've seen any more embarrassing losses or if you had any more embarrassing losses. If you have and you saved the replay, feel free to email me the link to the address down below, and I'll have a good laugh. See you later!